his last wood on the last end. Gave him a three. So they're five one up now. After four ends, it's a key end really. If Brian and Barry don't win this end, then it's going to be very difficult for, good, for good, difficult for them to win. If they do, then it keeps them in the match. Even a one will be sufficient at this stage. If they drop a one, it makes it six one. Two ends to go. It's uh, it's a long way back. Ian's a bit light here. He's just got in for shot though. Stone. Yeah, the shot from Barry there, he's drawn in shot That's wood. Short here. Don't think it's going to get over the line. No, it doesn't. Chance for Barry to put the second one in. Yeah, it's on a good line here. It's all about the weight. No, he's uh, just dropped the weight off. It's a good line, but I think the weight's too heavy and it's going to come all the way past. It might even go off. Yep. And chance for Bob Barry here to get the second one in. Yep, this is a good line and a good weight. He should just. Yeah, he's crept in for two. Two. So that two from Barry and Brian has brought the game back to 5 3. Um, Brian has just drawn a toucher there. After asking for a short jack, he's drawn it straight onto the jack. Yeah, this is a good response from me, and it's just behind. Yeah, in good okay. position. Jack doesn't stay on its spot very often, so it's a good receiving wood there. Yeah, and Brian's drawn another good wood, so partially protects first wood as well. Can you see it? Wondering whether are you able to do a short on your side? Yeah, I'll try it. One at the round the back, Brian. Push 
a jack on the way through and it's holding three at this moment in time. Katie's going to play slightly heavier. Yeah. He's looking just to hit one of those two. Oh, he's just gone past. Chance for Barry to draw in a fourth wood. Whichever you feel is best, Steve, you can get round that in the way. Yep, he's done that. We're holding three now, four, sorry. Three front woods, and the back wood on the right is, is in the count. Sharon's going to play slightly overweight and try and come into that bundle. Yeah, she's Any close time. for this. Yeah, she's taken one away, on. uh, two away. She's only two down now. Sharon's looking to put one behind, which is done. Yeah. Well done. Someone's got a play probably her own wood here. She's changing that in her mind. All the way through. Yeah, that's okay. Still holding two. Shall we have another go at it, I think? She's got something this time. Two. Final end here, score is 5-5 five, five. in the semi-final. Good fight back from Barry and Brian from 5-1 down. We'll see who wins. Ian's gone a bit narrow there, I think that might probably go off the side. Yeah. Yeah, good shot from Brian. Really forcing Ian onto his forehand, which is not his favourite hand. <laughs> He's done well here. Yeah. Yeah, well done. Holding one. <laughs> well, you wouldn't think that was possible, but Ian's just come through two woods and drawn second wood, so they're holding two now. 
just the skips remaining. Jack is wide open, so there was a draw there for Barry. Yeah, this is a good line. It's all on the weight now. I think it's okay. It's probably actually no. It's going to be too long. That was the right line, though. It would have. It did come back. Yeah, this is a good line from Sharon. Just oh. beats that front one, which is done. Made life really hard. They're holding three now. Barry's going straight for the orange one. It's just coming back now. And he's opened it up again. He's still three down, but it's wide open. Yep, that's off. So this is it. My Barry's got a draw to the jack for the win. If he misses, then Sharon and Ian are in the final. Oh. All over.